The objective with this is to reduce downtime and show customers that it's a quick, flexible method to get back up and running as soon as you can, so without spindles turning, no money earning, so back up and running as quick as possible. My name is Chris Judge, I'm the Head of Machining Technologies at Irish Manufacturing Research. Um, I currently work in the Precision Engineering section of IMR. Um, IMR is a not-for-profit, uh, state-funded organisation to help Irish manufacturing organisations um, explore, adopt uh, new and emerging technologies. Starig approached IMR about housing uh, the Boomotech uh, machine here in IMR. We were very delighted because it gives IMR the opportunity to bring um, some very advanced technology to precision engineering companies and allow um, precision engineering companies in Ireland to access that level of technology. And since then we have multiple companies engaging with us here, performing test cuts, uh, a test before invest kind of situation if you like. So, it allows company in a risk-free scenario to um, see the potential of the technology uh, if they invest in it. So we're hosting this event in the IMR at, in Mullingar and what we've done is rather than having a seminar where lots of people come together, we've done timed events where people can come on a one-to-one, -one, they can talk in private about their own problems and challenges on their own components, but they can see two very different components machined on the, the S191 Neo machine with a changeover in between. It's one of the big selling points of this machine is changing over from one job to another, as well as its capability. This machine's a Boomatec 191 Neo, a development for the old S191. Seven axis machining centre, mill turn, but a flexible machine with multi axis, multi positions, and multi uh, pickup stations. What we're trying to do at this event here at IMR is to demonstrate the quick changeover from one part, which is an anterior bone plate or spinal plate, to um, some ventral jaws, which are robotic arm features. So the quick change is changing vice jaws, main spindle collets, spindle liners from one to another, which is in the region of five to ten minutes and then you're back up and running we've got a probing program initially to set the tooling lens for each station that's been changed and then we're back up and running within literally 15-20 minutes As you can see here we have a very wide range of parts available from different industries there's the aerospace industry where there are parts in there from the fuel injection system for turbine and engines. There's the medtech industry for, for implant parts into the body and for the instruments as well to, for the operations to be, to be carried out with. And also the watchmaking industry, the micro mechanic in, in industry, particularly for the, the, the positioning, the very accurate positioning of some parts that may be fitted to satellites, etc. These, these materials can be from, from plastic, through to peak, through to stainless steel, uh, carbide we can machine, ceramics, both green and white hardened ceramics that you can only grind, uh, right through to titanium and even coral that gets implanted into the body. It's great to show the diversity of the machine and how quickly it can be changed over. Um, it's very important for people to know that about the Human Tech, that it's not just built for one application. Starig are, are really good to work with because their applications are really strong and the machines are so well built. So I'm the representative for Starig here in Ireland and if you're interested in increasing productivity and making parts faster, please get in touch.